All right, good day, welcome Librans. All right, this is gonna be your reading. All right, there's a reason why I don't do certain readings at certain times because I have just been getting a lot of low vibe stuff. So I've been really focusing um, on the more positive energies because I just, I don't seem to be picking up anything real positive. All right, so I'm gonna try to channel further out <clears throat> into the collective. All right, I'm going to channel further out into the collective here and reach out to some different ones if possible here, spirit, okay? Because for some, you can just go watch the old readings because nothing's really changed a whole lot. All right, so I'm going to try to reach out and see if I can get, you know, more positive reading further out into the collective here. For the Librans, please. Got the King of Pentacles. All right. So, with the King of Pentacles, obviously, you're focusing on stability when it comes to finances, security, all that kind of stuff. Could be a very protective energy. Could be a provider, business partner, businessman. Very reliable energy here. Very stable, secure, confident. The sun. Beautiful. So, yeah, you're really focusing on success and you're succeeding here, uh, Librans. Why did I want to say Capricorn? <laughs> Probably because Capricorns can be like that. I've known a few. All right. So, beautiful energy here. So, that's what you're focusing on, success. And you're doing it. You're doing it so so good got the knight of pentacles i feel like it's moving a little slow here all right but look at this all right all right it's moving a little slow right now with the knight of pentacles here but you have the chariot here so you're going to run into this chariot and that's when everything is going to take off for you all right that's when a lot of beautiful things are going to just take off all right you've got plans you've got a vision all right, Librans. You got the Queen of Cups. Yeah. It, you're going to be so happy. You're going to be like, you're going to cry with happiness. It's like tears of freaking joy here. All right. So some of you could be dealing with a Capricorn. All right. Some of you could be dealing with a Capricorn. All righty. <clears throat> the Knight of Pentacles kind of does things in a more practical way, right? And that's why, and then we have the Queen of Swords. Wow, somebody here is a brilliant person. Very, very brilliant. You're getting your Ace of Pentacles here, all right? Because you're brilliant. You're using your mind in a brilliant way. With this Queen of Cups, yeah, it's going to be. You're, and I feel like you're also like kind of letting your intuition guide you. All right, but yeah, you're being very logical and, you know, you don't put up with BS here. And we got the star card, beautiful energy. All right, your optimism is what's getting you there. Your faith is what's getting you there. All right, let's get this wrapped up for the Librans. This is a pretty simple, thank you, universe. Pretty simple. Wow, we have the Wheel of Fortune here with the Nine of Pentacles. Some of you are doing this all on your own. Yeah. Some of you are doing this all on your own. You decided you were going to let go of all the BS. Anything that was standing in your way, you're getting rid of it. All right? You're trying to sit back and think, what is it that I need to let go of? What is it that I need to cut out with the Four of Cups? And you're cutting it out. Because you realize what you need to do here. And you're going to go through a series of beautiful things here with the Nine of Pentacles. But your confidence... Is what's really getting you there. Your independence. Stunning. We do have Leo here. We do have Cancer here. And we do have Aquarius. Alright. We have uh, Scorpio. And Leo. I already said that, right? And Taurus intuition yes with this queen of cups you're you're listening to your intuition you're letting it guide you 
Got the plane here. You're going to be going places here. You're going places with the chariot. Whether it's a plane or a car, you're going places. All right? Because you're doing the work. We got movement. Yeah. Your intuition is moving you where you need to be. Some of you may have made an altar where you're kind of doing your um, chants, your visions, your affirmations, all that type of stuff. That's what you're working on here. All right? You're realizing you need to flow like water and meditate. Clear that mindset. That's what's bringing you into the Queen of Swords. That's when you really become victorious because you're using your mind wisely. You're using that intelligence, all right, to get you where you need to be. So I'm going to leave that there, Librans. You guys have a beautiful rest of your weekend, all right?